Today we're in Denville to learn about magic, tarot cards, and more. We're here at the Wren and the Raven. Molly, it's so great to be here at Wren and Raven. It's a business that was born out of the pandemic. Uh, yeah. How did you decide on the, the store and what you sell in here? When I was working as a therapist, um, one of the things that I was seeing a lot uh, was people who were very out of touch with their own power, with the thing that made them unique and magical as an individual. Um, and that was a lot of what sort of propelled the idea behind the shop. Um, so I really wanted it to be the kind of thing where it was a space where people could get in touch with their, their personal power and what makes them magic as an individual. Um, you can think of it from the perspective of like ritual and like witchy things and stuff like that, or you can think of it just from the perspective of like, what makes me feel rooted in, in my own power and my ability to affect change on my life. Um, so I think we all need a little bit more of that. Makes sense. I feel like it, I don't know, we got also disconnected over the last few years and Thank, isolated. Yes, exactly. Per, yeah, I, I think that people over the past few years, yes, we've got disconnected from each other, from ourselves, from the planet. I think people are realizing that the way that we used to do things just doesn't work anymore. And people are looking for different ways of connecting, of connecting, like period. And what are some of the most popular items that you sell in the store? Probably the crystals. People love crystals. Um, we sell a lot of crystals, but crystals, candles, spell kits, it, there's a pretty um, even mix of everything. I'm gonna have to bring my daughter. She loves crystals. <laughs> Kids do, yeah. <laughs> and you also have classes. What kind of classes do you offer? So we have um, a monthly schedule of classes. We uh, have tarot readings. We have classes where you can learn to read tarot yourself. Um, we have a new moon meditation sound bath. Um, we do some community-based classes um, where people sort of learn about more of the ritual side of stuff together. Um, yeah, it, it can vary from month to month. And the tarot readings, are those just scheduled and they have certain days that they can come in? Yeah, so our readers are here on predetermined days and um, folks can go online and schedule an appointment there. And then if they're interested, they can learn to read tarot as well. Yeah, so we have um, a Foundations of Tarot uh, level class, so if that's if you have no experience whatsoever. We also are in the middle of an intermediate uh, level class, which spans over the course of seven weeks. I think we're on week five or six now, which has been going really great. And then we also have our tarot workshop where people can come and just kind of, it's a casual atmosphere where people can hang out and talk about tarot and grab insights from each other. And you also sell the tarot cards mm -hmm. in the back of the store. Yes, we do. Mm -hmm. Is there a special thing about different types of tarot cards? We primarily carry what's called the Smith Waite deck. Um, it's a like a famous deck that a lot of people recognize. Some people know it as the Rider Waite deck. Um, and a lot of people learn how to read tarot on that deck. And then a lot of other decks are based on that deck. We do carry that deck. We have another deck that's based on that. Um, but because we are so focused on people learning to read tarot, that is a deck we focus on. And what we love about local businesses is how they give back. How does Ren and Raven give back? Well, so everything that we carry um, is, like we really try to focus on small businesses owned by women, folks um, who are members of the LGBTQ community or folks of color. Um, so we are very conscious and inclusive in terms of, um, you know, from a social justice perspective. Um, right now we are doing our um, pride window display. So people can come and they can give a donation to EDGE New Jersey, which is um, a local organization that provides support services for people living with HIV and the LGBTQ community. And um, we're having folks write a message of support to the LGBTQ community and putting it in the window to create a pride flag. So, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's such a cool idea to have yeah. it up in the window. Yeah, okay. it's nice because I, I just think people need to see you know, messages of love and support from, from their community. All right, great. Thanks so much to Molly for sharing the Wren and the Raven story. If you're interested in tarot readings, classes, uh, tarot cards, mm -hmm. crystals, and so much more magical things in your <laughs> life, uh, definitely come out to Denville and come out to the Wren and the Raven. 
If you like this video, please share it and also visit buylocalnj.com. Thanks so much. Thank you.